So I use this tool that I will send to you later to pick cards based on a rating in addition to what I know about how to pick arena deck. So you can see the curve is really smooth for a mid-range deck. It's not super good on turn one. I have two executes a whirlwind and then a blood sale course there, which I'm almost certainly not going to get. I've got an okay section of two drops. Tide Hunter, two Mad Bombers, uh, a Stalker and a Raptor, plus the Owl which is, you know, pretty situational. The real power comes at three. I've got the Death Lord, which is the, but I have three Frothing Berserkers, plus Demolisher, Nip Master, and uh, the Mind Control Tech. I also have this little Exorcist. I forget what I was paired up with, but it was... Well, maybe it'll show me. Uh, let's see. That. Uh, the little exorcist was paired up against the armor smith and the cold light seer, which was interesting because that was one of the one of several times where it suggested something which was contrary to my instinct. Uh, I was going to take the Armorsmith, but the explanation was the Armorsmith is not great in the arena because of the the uh, lack of ability to synergize with armor. The other one was... what? Oh, right, so it gave me three good choices, a Siege Engine, a Wild Pyromancer, and the Imp Master. My instinct was to go with the Siege Engine, because it's such a beefy minion, plus the health. Uh, and it gave it a value of 60, it was actually good. The Pyromancer was valued at 74 and great. The Imp Master was valued at 71, or 77 and great. Um, the explanation indicated that it's often underestimated because it's a subtle threat. You know, you can build up a board full of imps and it's not often easily taken care of, especially because you can't count on having AoE to, uh, to deal with it. Uh, in addition, I've got three Cochrane Elites and two Dark Iron Dwarves in the four section. The fours are going to be really strong for me. I've got a lack of good endgame. Uh, Sunwalker, Spectral Knight, Sludge Belcher, and that's pretty much it. And I did not get offered any good beefy minions. So, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to say we'll conservatively estimate nine wins. Stores out of that's Max again, so I'm drinking my yellow pea. No beer tonight, I regretted that last night. Not really, actually, I didn't want to that. Okay, okay. This is pretty good. In fact, I'm reluctant to get rid of it. Maybe it's the Warlock, so maybe I drop the Stalker and see if I can't get... Nope, I'm just going to keep it. Alright, can't do anything. Next turn, let's see what he drops. If it's something weak, I might put up the Raptor. Or nothing, I'll definitely put up the Raptor there. If he puts out something easily killed. Oh, okay, Dark Bomb. All right. Hmm. Oh, let Barry 
We must cleanse the sun well. Alright, so I'm going to put out the Berserker and trade Hmm. What now? Yeah. <laughs> he must not have had any other good three drops because to drop that without having anything to put it on is pretty bad. If Do I play the Cockrun? What do we have? Oh, I think you're right, Jeffrey. So I can play what? I can play. I can play this and take a chance. Or I can guarantee its removal with the Cockrun. I think that's what I'm going to do. Even though it's pretty shitty for the code. That keeps him from getting cheap mechs out. Okay. Right, that took him two cards to get rid of that. That's uh, The light compelled you. Let's see what we can do with this. That was annoying. I shouldn't have taken the Mad Bombers because I can never count on my luck. Not ever. So <laughs> I will say he's in the danger zone. Danger zone! But he's going to be pretty reluctant to life tap. That 2-2. Two, two. Trades okay. I've got execute, so I think I'm going to play the mind control tech and her armor up and go for face. He can't go for the face. He's got to reduce the threats. So he'll probably kill the Yeti, which I will dispose of with the Dwarf on this guy. Two Hellfires. That's interesting. He got rid of his own dude. Alright, well.
Probably should have saved that owl. That's all right. He still loses. Okay. Good start. From von Klein. Doctor von Klein. <coughs> Knuckles. All right, that's not really super good against a mage. Let's see what else we got. Okay, <coughs> that's a pretty good curve. So we'll play Gelbin. The plan to play Frothing next turn, depending on what she plays. I have a coin too, but I don't have any other two drops. So we'll save the coin and potentially coin out the Cockrum if she plays something pretty gross on turn two. I wonder. Well, could you wander a little faster? Maybe? Or you could just time out and give me the free win. Well, I did that too. Ready for action. Well, what to do? Goldshire Footman, not generally regarded as being a very good minion. See if we get lucky? I think we should. Well, I guess I deserved that, didn't I? Uh, <coughs> Trades pretty well with that. She has that, of course.
Okay. <coughs> Secret, eh? Let's see. Should we test for mere entity? Right. Nope, there it is. Flame can hit the yay. Nice. thing, isn't it? <clears throat> what do I want to do? out four minions just in case he's got it. Ahem. <clears throat> 
And now what? <coughs> wow, three mechanical yetis. All right. <coughs> My goal and execute to boot. So this is uh, doing okay so far. I feel like that mage would have kicked my ass if I had picked this deck myself. But you never know. Salsa. Cilantro. Alright, don't need this, don't need that. I'm going to keep those two. Mm, that's less than ideal. <coughs> Man of Worm. Not doing super great. Snow Sugar. She'll be able to kill it with both of these and her blast. I think I'm actually going to put that out and hope that she doesn't have flame cannon. <clears throat> that might actually be awkward for her to kill. Good. She doesn't quite know how to deal with it. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Can put another one out. Yeah, I think so. I hope she doesn't have another frostbolt. We must cleanse the sun well. I am ready. Interesting. <laughs> Pretty good luck with her draws. I will say that. Oh, 
That was stupid. I should have taken out the 3-3. Three, three. Six, seventy nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. He's got lethal on the board, nothing I can do that. <clears throat> what a terrible draw I had, Jesus. They had an amazing draw. Having the Specter Knight in my opening hand when I have so many twos and threes is really not ideal. Hello. A vast matey. Jesus. Tempting to do this, but I would love to get rid of that knife juggler. Which I think I'm gonna do. See what he does with that. It's not a very threatening board. And I'm sure he would hate to waste hex on it. Lightning Bolt doesn't get rid of it. Earth Shock would probably be okay here for him, though it wouldn't kill it. Zombie chow. That's interesting. Oh, 
Alright, this is pretty good. If he's got Lightning Storm, he can use it and possibly kill both of them. That moves it to 3-4 range. Or he could miss both of them, and that would suck, and he would get Overload. That would be pretty much all he could do. I wonder. If he can't respond to this very well, I could kill the totem and get a free buff to my Berserker. And put my Taunt out. Well, if he can't put anything down, then I wouldn't even need to kill that totem because the Demolisher will do it for me. Seems like he's in a bit of a spot. An awful lot of cards. One of them is the coin, so that gives him six actual cards. That's interesting. That is super interesting. I can clear that thing. He has three overload next turn. So I can put the Frost Wolf Warlord out. And then I hit that. That'll move him up to six. No, maybe I need to do this. Yeah, I think I need to do this. Because I need to get that... Yeah, I need this. The next turn he's only going to have two mana to play. No, oh, he's got three. Alright, because it's six. But still, that's pretty awesome. Got that out of the way. That could have been a real problem. I wish I had silence though. That would have been excellent. I am ready. Okay. Pretty awesome. Could play a fire elemental to kill the three two. That's pretty much all he could do. Fire elemental six. I'm gonna go to lightning bolt if he had it, but he wouldn't be able to kill anything with it. He could Lightning Bolt and Fire Elemental to 6-6, six, six, which I would prefer that he did not do, if I'm being perfectly honest. I wonder. That's good. That's what I was hoping he would do. He's got one mana left. Can he use it? He could coin something out for two mana, but that would not do much for him. I can clear the 6-5 with the Frostwolf, of course. Should I, is the question. Let's see what this ends up being. He coined out, hoping for a Tauntaun. He did not get it. Alright, I am going to K 
kill the 6-5. Play this and this. Running pretty short on cards. I'm hoping he doesn't have any decent answers for this stuff. That is an interesting technique. <laughs> and that's just tragic. That did not work out. He has got to be lamenting that move. Did that do overload? Nope. I'll be able to do 10 next turn. I'll take another 16. Max of desperation a bit. I'm just going to hold on to this stuff. Probably should have killed that spell power totem. But he has no really severe threats on the board. Even if he rolls a 4 on my 4-4, four, four, can't kill the 4 6 or the 2 8. I'm hoping I'll get to 3 on the dwarf. What a bitch. You got it. But still, it's not even terrible. Hmm. That is another not so good choice. He had a lot of spells, I'll give him that. I could really use my weapon. With what he's got on the board, he can't clear those taunts. He can kill them, the Sunwalker, but it would be costly. He'd probably pop the shield with the 2 1 and then hit with the 4 2 and the 2 3. Oh, uh -oh. he's got Hex. <laughs> That is annoying. Where's my sword? There we go. Super duper annoying.
I'm gonna get screwed here because of that fucking totem. God damn it. Ugh. He got all of his spells in his draw. Every single spell. That was my goddamn execute tell. Oh my god, this sucks. Now he's gonna get healed to full. I have no way of drawing more than one card at a time, so um, boom. Eh, uh, fuck it. That sucked. I was kicking his ass. Eh, whatever.